Today we're going to draw the rainbow fish. Okay, this is halfway through our finished one. First of all, we're going to start with using a pencil. We're going to do a big circle, almost a circle. So going round, big side face, all the way round. Going to leave a little gap for the lips. And we're going to come finish that all the way round and bring that back to the middle, leaving the gap there. We're going to come up for a, do a gentle happy face and a sad face for the tail. We're going to come up, gentle curve, gentle sad face, gentle happy face. We're going to do a curve corner. And curve at the corner there. We're going to come round, big happy face in the middle. Next we're going to do our lips, so we're going to come over, do a big happy face, like that, so big sad face into a happy face. Come round, come round, got a couple of little bumps there, like an N, and then happy face there. I'm going to join that up. I've got some big lips. Next we're going to add the fins on. So underneath here. I'm going to come down for triangle. Oh, I'm going to run out of room. I'm going to come down there. You can actually rub this line out in between. So I'm just going to give that little rub out. It doesn't matter if it's there, but you can if you want to. Then we're going to come down. Curve. And back up. Put a gentle curve on there. The top one's a bit different, so we're going to go over for a sad face into a happy face and up, round, happy face into a sad face. Last fin is at the bottom, so it's just down, curve, and we're going to do like a little triangle on there. Just going to add a couple of wavy lines through the middle and down. Next bit we're going to do is um, round the face. So it has some curves. So one. So we're just going to gently curve it round. I'm going to do about four of these and then one big one. Next I'm going to do the eye. A big circle for the eye in the middle. Circle it and then a little white dot for a little bit of light, and then an eyebrow coming over the top. To do the um, scales of the fish, you're going to come into the middle of this one. From the middle of this one, we need to get to the middle of the next one. So we're going to come up over to the middle. From the middle of there over to the middle of there over to the middle now we haven't got none here so we have to pretend there's some over around next we're going to come over we're going to start there and go to the middle of this one to the middle over over into the middle each time of the next one and you're going to do that all the way till you get to this part of his tail. Okay. I won't finish all mine. I'll just show you. Right, next what I've used, I'm going to use an outline. I'm going to use my oil pastels. If you haven't, you can use colouring pencils. I wouldn't use felt pit tips for this one because I'm going to show you what I want to do. So I'm going to go round and trace over. Instead of a black pen... I'm going to trace over absolutely everything in your and all the scales. Okay, so you'll do all that. I'm just going to show you this one like I wanted done earlier. So when you finish that, you can do the eye in black, the lips are orange, and then you can pick all lots of rainbow colours. So I've still used the pastels 
and I've coloured it in lots of beautiful rainbow colours. I've added a tiny bit of purple very lightly in the corners on the fins. Next, all I've done is get some water and put a bit of paint on and made like a really runny watercolour base. What we're going to do is get this straight. Let's just go over this with the water. So we're going to do it in stripes. So you're going to come across all over the top of your work. one end to the other end don't stop till you get to the other end because the oil pastel is like wax it's got a resistance on it so it will go over the top and fill in any gaps of your um, white paper and it will look like the um, sea like in the rainbow fish If you wish to, you can add all your seaweed. So if you want to do that um, beforehand, in bits of paper that haven't got any white, got any white bits. If you wish to um, do your seaweed, you can do that first and do all your detail where you want your rainbow fish to be swimming. So then all you're going to do is leave that. So let's just pull that one out that's the one I did earlier so all you're going to do is leave that one to dry and there is our beautiful rainbow fish have fun guys